What's up, Guru Gang peeps, Padawans? Welcome to the Inner Sanctum. I'm Yoda Guru. Come on in, sit, stay, relax, put your feet up, grab a couple snacks, have yourself a cold beverage, your choice, your prerogative. My sanctum is your sanctum. Enjoy my reaction to episode 5 of the uh, 80s series of just 8 episodes, Manimal. And this particular episode is entitled High Stakes. And um, so far I've enjoyed this series and I hope you enjoyed uh, my reaction to this series. And like I said before, uh, I've heard about this series growing up. I never really watched it. I was more into A-Team, Airwolf, Knight Rider, and then um, uh, shows like Street Hawk. Um, and which I did, which I did a reaction video to for the 80s one season wonder, um, section. And, the, like, and, um, there's more to come when it comes to, um, 80s one season, uh, wonder series, uh, shows that all had, like I said, one season. Um, so look out for that. Stay tuned for that. In any case, with that said, um, before he heading into the reaction part of this video, go ahead, hit like, hit subscribe. Hit that notification bell in order to be notified of any future videos being posted on either channel when it comes to um, my either my um, Inner Sanctum channel or my YG Anime channel, um, of, of all things anime. And um, like always, I've mentioned before, all my full-length reaction videos will be posted either on my Patreon or on my Rumble. Both links, along with my social media links, will be posted underneath this video in the, sec in the description section. So with that said, let's get into episode 5, um, entitled uh, High Stakes of Manimal, um, the 80s one season wonder series that um, that you clicked on for today. In any case, let's go. Alright. Alright. Um, it looks like a Kentucky Derby type setting. Identification tattoo 81225877. 81225877. Identification verified. Mm -hmm. Hey, this is him. Dusty Day. Oh, that's so magnificent, these thoroughbreds. So high strung, proud, and competitive. Look here, JC. As long as you got this nice one on one going with hmm. him, uh, why don't you ask him if he's up for winning yeah. today? JC's yeah, oh, literally got the inside the scoop, if you say. If you I don't like people handling my horse. Um, Tracy Scoggins, uh, well, I know her from uh, Babylon 5, one of the best uh, sci-fi series you. out there. Now, if you'll excuse us. Ladies and gentlemen, may we now draw your attention to the sky 3,000 feet above the grandstand, where members of local parachute clubs will display their award-winning form. All right, now! Uh -oh. Something happened. They, uh, turn out bad. Falling at more than 120 miles an hour. The Two. Yeah, this shoe's not opening. Let's make that switch. Just love the word oh, horse stealing. Horse stealing. Oh, Jason's now gonna uh, 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 transform into a bird. But still, he has not used his, and the first timer is falling on Looks like he is. He looks to be totally out of control at this point. Yeah, hurry up there. Just like a booking, making a call from his car after the track has already locked up the phones. Give me a break, will you, Ty? Long shot? In the next race? Marv? Uh, listen, I need to lay off 20 G's on Papa's lad. Hey, cover the bet yourself, Trout. That nag so slow he's starting the race at 3 0, won't finish till he's 4. No one's going to risk this kind of bread betting on a 65 to 1 shot to win unless he knows something that you and me don't. Come. I don't know what happened. I've never passed out before. Uh, it's a common reaction when a parachute malfunctions. No, that couldn't be it. I packed that rig myself, same as for a thousand other jumps. 
And you don't think that someone could have tampered with it after that? Mister, I don't know what to think. I just know it's a miracle I'm alive. Here you are. I have the tip of the century. I put all my money on another horse and now the windows are closed. JC, where have you been? Oh, I'm sorry, Ty. I'm going to take off for a bit. <laughs> Bit of cheating going on before him. It's not Papa's land. Fine job of riding, young lady. What do you think you're doing? I want to see your horse, McGann. I'd have thought you'd have seen enough of Papa's land for one day. Yes. But he wouldn't be if you'd have paid the ransom. I don't have $10 million. I offered to loan it to you. Oh, yeah, for stud like that. <laughs> I caught an old trout kicking holes in the clubhouse wall. It says a hundred grand came in on Papa's land at the last minute, spread out with bookies all over the city. I think... Please don't leave it! They got my horse like... Go, you're crazy! She'll be locked up! Get her out of here! What's this all about? I want you to check the identification on Papa's land. Identifications are verified. I trained him. I know the way he runs. I know every muscle movement. Even when she was whipping him, she, she had to hold him back so he wouldn't <laughs> show too much. Couldn't you see that? Miss Bonnet, everyone felt the loss when a great horse like Splendid Dancer was kidnapped. But these accusations... Splendid Dancer has a white star on his forehead. That's smirk. That's Papa's land doesn't. Well, perhaps they use cosmetics to change his look. Oh, he's running. He's running. Seven, seven. Papa's lad. No sign of tampering. It's him. I know it was. They must have switched him somewhere between here and the winter circle. It's all right, Miss Bonnet. Hey, 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 wait, 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 wait. If she's right, and they slipped in a ringer, and he gets disqualified, then I'm holding the winning tickets. Hey, wait, wait. Oh, excuse me, this is an emergency. We're not. Trying to do his job, man. <laughs> You're probably breaking your poor old mama's heart. <laughs> I don't know why they call you cops the heat, man. You look like cold fish to me. Tommy! I'm gonna sue you and your whole precinct! <laughs> why am I glad to see you again? I didn't think that bus would ever go down. Come on, you had me convinced this was a big one. You look great. Uh, maybe you should dress like this all the time, huh? Splendid dancer. Kidnapped after winning Derby. <laughs> hey, baby, money, money, money. Oh, yeah, found another one. Please. My ticket's to heaven. Might as well get back down on my knees and start praying again. <laughs> right, talk about it being hot in here. Like it? Well, suffice to say, you're going to have to be careful not to bring out the animal in me. Which one? <laughs> oh, now that depends on whether you'd like me to make you purr like a kitten or raw. Why don't you two quit it? I never know whether to laugh or leave the room. <laughs> leave the room. Nah. A kidnapper would be able to get back the ransom money that he never made in the first place. You mean you think that parachute mess up was a diversion so they could slip in a ring for Papa's land? Mm -hmm. A six million dollar payoff, stud rights, and all the other et ceteras. Come on, little fella. You gotta drink something or you're not gonna make it. Your mama still loves you. Just sick, that's all. Put some on my finger. There we go. Big little guy. I work 
for the NYPD as a consultant, Special Investigations Unit. Now, if Splendid Dancer is still alive... He is alive. Well, then we want to help you get him back. Now, can you help me to know him if indeed his looks have been cosmetically altered? They outrun everything. Cars, dogs, even jet planes that flew over. He just has a spirit that you can feel when you're near him. Oh, there he goes. We've got to get closer. You take the high road, I'll take the low road. In heels, no less. <laughs> Fairly and I'll burn them. You treat me unfairly, I'll burn you with them. Now, you must remember... I'm an unscrupulous man. That's why you hired me. And you uh -huh. must remember that you're not He's on the take. Expat taxi. Thanks for leaving me out. Well, what am I saying? Never mind. You gotta get out of here. I'm in solid. I'll stick around and see what else I can find out. Be careful. Be careful's my middle name. Hmm. Green Tree works out of that building. Be careful. I'm always careful. Let's check in this room. I thought I heard something. Killer. Happen, but nowhere near here. Got it? Do it. Kathy? Mrs. Bonin, you in there? Yes, who's that? Time on earth. JC's friend. Just hang tight and we'll get you out of there. God's playing a dancer. He's here. I know, woman. Let's just get you out of here right now. You two aren't going anywhere. What I say? Use the lock as a as a <laughs> like a brass knuckles. Come on, give me the excuse. Hmm. Captured. Howdy, sugar. I'm Mrs. Austin, and this is my <laughs> horse trainer Charles, and we're here to see Mr. McGann for an appointment. Appointment? I'll see if he's in. Can't you get us out of here? Since if there was a lock on the inside, we'd be off and running. But... <laughs> hey, come on now, Kathy. No need for tears. Look, everything's gonna be all right. Look at this. You see the champagne? Go ahead. Go on, make it feel better. <laughs> I meant drink it. <laughs> second we saw him, I said, Charles, I said, I will not allow another horse near my little mare. Isn't that what I said, sweet pea? <laughs> Mrs. Austin is very uh, picky. Then I am sure that if Papa's lad wins a few more races, Mr. McGowan will put him out of his indication. And, well, I mean, how much money do you think you'll be able to make for a horse of that quality, Mr. McGowan? Uh, ten million, twenty perhaps, depending. Now, if you're interested in purchasing a share, I would be more than happy to do 
discuss that with you. Uh, I do have some very fine studs available if you'd like to see them. Yes. Yes, I think we would. Fine. Then I'll just have my trainer, Mr. Whittington, show you through the stables. He's going to turn into a horse. There you go. Is that you? Jonathan, is that you? Ah, ah. <laughs> Jonathan, a simple nod would suffice. Hmm? Let's get cooking on plan A. Jonathan, you sure this plan's gonna work? <laughs> Set the haystack on fire. A pile of hay on fire. Fire! Grab the extinguisher! seen anyone handle a horse like that. Well, brother man, my luck has changed. Soon as Papa's leg gets disqualified, I'm in the chips. Time. Where are your tickets? Dashed away where only I can find them. Ah! Come on, 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 come Oh, don't worry, Ty, he will give it back. But I'm afraid not in any form that you'll be able to cash in. <laughs> I found another one. <laughs> hey, come on. Give it. That's my money. No. Come on, take it back. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Overall, I actually enjoyed this episode. Uh, episode 5, High Stakes. Um, knowing how that um, one of the many animals that JC can turn into is a horse. He's already turned into a dolphin. Um, a, a hawk, a panther. At one point, I thought he turned uh, in past in the past episodes, um, it uh, turned into a snake and an elephant. But those were misdirects. And anyways, uh, one of the humorous uh, humorous um, things about the episode was Ty when he thought he lost, but then he won because uh, the bad guy uh, owner and um, and the, the the horse trainer or doctor turned out to be a uh, a um, taxidermist. Um, paid by the bad guy owner, horse trainer, like something like that, um, was on the take. So yeah, and uh, it it uh, ended up with um, uh, uh, Brooke riding JC in horse form, and uh, and that, in the end, it um, JC's backside was a little tender after the uh, bad guy um, horse trainer, the female horse trainer. Um, was trying to break him in order to comply with um, her orders, but um, JC didn't have any of, was not having any of it, so she bucked him off, got knocked out a bit, and they all got arrested in the end. And um, like I said, it was a thoroughly entertaining episode, especially for Ty knowing that 
he, even though he um, got the tickets and was able to um, uh, able to uh, uh, find the uh, the ripped up ticket and store it in a place that he would only know the a goat would end up eating it and thus would uh, would uh, cause his unfortunate uh, money loss. In any case, hope you enjoyed my reaction to episode five of High Stakes, the horse themed um, episode. And um, hopefully we'll get to see more of um, what animals uh, JC will be able to turn into in the final three episodes of the eight-episode series um, of the 80s um, one-season wonder um, when it comes to this particular um, uh, series that um, didn't get much uh, traction into becoming um, uh uh, more than it, or more than it was when it comes to a series uh, full episodes um, like at, at 12 or 13 or 22 or uh, or a seasons at, uh, more seasons as well. Um, in any case, if you enjoyed my reaction to this video or any of my reactions for Intersective Channel or my uh, YG Anime Channel for all things anime, hit like, hit subscribe. Hit that notification bell in order to be notified of any future videos being posted on either channel. And like always, all my full-length reaction videos will be posted on either my Patreon or my uh, Rumble. And both links, along with my social media links, will be posted underneath this video and in the description section. And with that said, I tip my hat to you, and may the force be with you. Alright, later.